Good morning, everybody, and welcome to the second episode of our flea market tour in the south of France. I already miss my Italian cappuccino. Luckily, they have good pastries. Anyway, for today we planned to visit three different Vide Grenier or garage sales and we are on the road to see the first one. Livello altissimo, eh? Mamma mia, che il massimo che possiamo sperare per pagare tutto a euro. So, hi guys, I'm in good company today. <laughs> so, this is the second day of our stay here in the south of France. Today we are in Marsiglia, Marseille, I don't know how to say it in English. And uh, there's the Vide Grenier here, and we are very excited. So, let's go and see what we can find. <laughs> In this market there are only private sellers, they are selling the things that they don't need anymore and that's why we hope to find some very good deals. Bello, mi piace. Carino, vero? Eh? Sì, molto. Quanto? 20, ma... Mm. Trattable. I spotted these two candle holders for 15 euros and I was hoping for a better price. The guys are looking for model cars and also spare parts and old signs, that kind of stuff. The prices here are good, 2 euros, 5 euros. I like that Chinese panel, it is hand painted and it is very elegant. È bello anche il cesto. Eh? È bello anche il cesto. Sì. E anche il tavolino dietro, è tutto bello. Anche quello che ha in mano la signora. Ah sì, anche la tegliera. Eh, lo stanno prendendo loro. Here we have a cute vintage lamp with a brass base, then a strange unidentified object and a couple of candlesticks. I like them. I am looking for true vintage clothes, but it seems very difficult to find any here because there are tons of clothes and I surely don't have the time to go through all of them. But at the end of this rack I have found this old blazer and I can tell you that this has got potential. These old weights could be displayed on a shelf, in a kitchen, I think they are very cool. I am looking for a t-shirt to wear tomorrow because yesterday it was so hot and I only have long sleeved shirts in my luggage. Yesterday Theo has purchased a bag full of gambling chips and today I've found the roulette and we can now open like a clandestine casino. Madonna. Questo nuovo con cartellino per domani, troppo estivo. This skirt is nice, it has a good color combination and these flowered stripes, it costs only one euro. So you are um, yesterday's winner of our competition. Every yes, day, <laughs> every day we have a, um, a, challenge. a challenge that is to take a picture of an item thank you Lele <laughs> take a picture of an item that follows a certain theme and today the theme will be the squirrel that is very difficult to find today but we will see, we'll see. the day is long yeah. <laughs> if you're curious to see my purchases uh, stay till the end of the video because I will show you the whole of the day and I can tell you that there will be some amazing pieces I like wooden figurines and this seems a, a pelican or maybe a crane what do you think? Let's have a look to these scarves. Mm, 
this is the only one made of silk and uh, I'm searching for the signature but I can't find any. Um, well, it has a beautiful print but it is not in good conditions so I guess I'm gonna pass on this one. Judy Cosa? Guess. Gucci. A small print of this uh, uh, 1929 calendar with a cute scene of that period. And what about the cute little elephants? What is it? I spotted this cute vest and for only 50 cents <laughs> this is coming home with us. In the meantime, my husband has found some interesting dishes. Christine? Uh. Carini? This one comes from Vidart, that is a town in the north of France. Gira, gira li tutti. Ciao, fai. Bellini. Three plates, beautiful plates. You've got good eye for dishes, decorated dishes. dishes. Ah, no plates, okay. Or plates. Ah, I just say it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Very good. Very good. If you are enjoying this market, let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and maybe subscribe to this channel so you won't miss the next episode of our French trip. Qualcuno di questi quadretti che ti Lo scatolino in legno ti piace? This box is very nice, but I prefer the ones with the floral decorations. Si sì, carino ma non eccezionale. This belt is nice, but I don't know. I'm also looking for vintage leather belts. Today I'm wearing vintage belts that I bought yesterday. This is nice and I could have put it in my bathroom, but I didn't think about it, so I didn't take it. This winter I was looking for a shirling coat just like this, but now it's so hot that I can't even think of trying it on. I spotted a fake Louis Vuitton bag. In every market we find at least a fake Vuitton bag. And there is also a Gucci one. This mirror is very cute, it is made of a filigree, it's 20 euros because the owner says uh, it's made of silver, but there's no mark on it, so I'm gonna pass. That lampshade is hand painted with beautiful flowers and I like it very much. This is a nice display for jewelry. The base is made of onyx, but I think the golden part is uh, too golden. I don't know if that makes sense. Somebody has spotted the first squirrel and uh, has sent uh, this picture on WhatsApp. I have to admit that today it is a more difficult challenge. Another cute little mirror, but I was hoping for a more precious bag. This one is made of plastic. Troppo grande. La lì dietro? Non mi sta adesso. Troppo grande la brocca? Sì, direi troppo grande. Porta fiori. Sì, tanti fiori. A bunch of animal figurines. Let me see if there's any squirrel. No, there's not. But in the meantime, somebody has found another furry one. Oh, wow. 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 Oh, This hand-painted dish is very nice. It comes from Spain. Maybe the color is too dark, I don't know. A bag by Pourchet Paris, 
made in France. It is made of leather, but the lining inside is faux leather and it is a bit damaged, so I'm gonna pass on this one. And this with fringes is uh, faux leather. A nice shirt by Rodier, made in France, Paris. This is a good old brand, two euros for this one. Very nice and peaceful. This landscape is giving me good vibes. Sì, sì. C'è troppa roba. <laughs> allora, ho pazienza. Aiutami perché mi casca qualcosa. Questo quadretto che ora non riesco a tirare su. Aspetta che lo inquadriamo così. I santi appoggiati. Di... Lo rovescerò. Sì. Allora, in realtà potremmo perché dietro c'è la cosa più delicata di tutte. Che yeah. è? Dara. Ah, li conosco questi piatti qua. Ah, Credo no. forse. Molto carino. A Neuro sono molto contenta. <ride> ehm, questa mm. marca qua. Uh, Villeroy. Villeroy. Ah, Villeroy Bock, sì. top. Di latta con i treni. Molto carino. Sì. Molto, molto. Siamo già cresciuti. Siamo già cresciuti oh, moltissimo. Oh, il is empty. <ride> Ma ah, quindi la poltrona se si trova, no? È proprio sì, sì, la compriamo sicuro. Vediamo. Le mercatelle delle scovate. Ah, una borsettina filigrana. Che bella. Che lì c'è? Vid Grenier. I per casino. Brava uova, brava uova. Meno male. Era nascosto molto bene. Dove? E adesso mi fate una domanda troppo specifica, che ne so? Cartello giallo, a destra, a destra, dritto, 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 c'è un cartello giallo. This small flea market is on the rooftop of a supermarket. It seems very junky, but I think that you can never know what you can find. Here I'm looking for leather belts and I have found another one with the dog pins. These are one euro each. If you are curious to see what I purchased today, uh, stay till the end of the video because I've got a huge haul to show you. They have some nice plates, like this one that seems uh, Japanese. Nice colors. A shabby chic mirror, dusty but cute. Somebody liked to collect owls. Here they have a nice trays and baskets. Le vassoi? Le vassoi e ora ho le mani occupate. Parecchio occupate. Oh, quella scatola è carina. Molto carina. Le petite de télécommande. Il classique. Nouveau dictionnaire des injures. Tu n'es qu'une lopette. Un minable, un sans besoin, un dégonflé, un pauvre qui te mange le morceau. L'avete gonflé? È molto, uh, come dire, eh, dolce. Come, come si dice? Che ti sfoghi leggendolo. Oh no. Puoi essere so, molto fantasioso con. So, so dire una parola ogni due, però. Insulti. couple of uh, metallic leaves. They are very heavy, but they cost 20 euros. This terracotta vase is super cool. Look at the shiny pink gold decorations. This vintage striped blazer is very cool. I don't know, in these days I'm obsessed with yellow things. Ancora leggete il libro? Sono arrivato sacripante. Non lo posso mettere nel video. Oh. <laughs> <ride> Eccolo, che bello! Vedere, vedere, vedere. Super. Le scinquine da Redamonte. Da lavare un pochetto. Un po', un po lavare. Lavare. Ormai Nico è Vibre. marrone. Eh. Esatto. Ciao, molto guapo. carino, molto carino. Eh? Vediamo Mary. Bella questa figata. Wow. Questa cosa wow. mettela così. Non le ho colorate, non ne ho pensato. Ho detto, ma... E questa questa figata. Questo? Quanto costava? Voleva 10 all'uno e alla fine 15 più Oh, l'ho visto anche io questo. Ah, me lo, me lo ricordo. Felice lui, devo dire. Fa bellissimo. Sì. Poi funziona anche. Sì, sì, figata. 
Za lavarli kol napal. We are on the way to the third market of the day. I think that this will be on a higher level uh, compared to the other two that we visited today and uh, it is in a beautiful location close to the beach of uh, Marseille. L'abbiamo trovato? Questo qua? Sì. Tappeto con le farfalle! Quanto è grande? Tappeto eh, tutta, tutta la via, sì, è questo. È questo per forza, dai. Via, yeah, parcheggia sto furgone. Trube, trube. Ah, c'era un tappeto con le farfalle. Ah, buono. Non ho capito, lo puoi ridire? As usual, I will put the name and locations of this Vide Grenier down in the info box. Oh mio Dio, ce l'avevo sta cosa. Tipo Giovanni Marmotte? Sì! Con tutte le... Gli accessori. <ride> complicato. Molto complicato. Hai trovato? Cosa hai trovato? Mi piace? Non mi sai come. Per me? Eh, ci senti, è rotto. Beh, ma tu non lo puoi riparare? No, è rotto il... 5 euro. And finally, my husband has found a French coffee pot. Sarebbe quella, ma... Eh, ma a noi piacciono smaltate. Eh, anche a me. Che belli questi piatti. Mm. Che bello. Here there is a selection of vintage clothes. The one I like best is this floral jacket, but it is not my size. There is also this blue women's suit that uh, reminds me of Chanel. It's very nice. And then I'm trying to understand if these are silk scarves or not. They have the edges stitched by machine, so they are not very precious. Amore, ho trovato 10 euro. Hai trovato 10 euro? La A 10 euro. Ah, ah, 10 Io euro. la prenderei perché a casa nostra chiedono 50. Ma che cosa? La Cosa avete pescato? Che cos'è? Una scatola... Una scatolina particolare. <laughs> This is a very strange object. The owner said that it was used to contain sugar and the price is 10 euros. But it seems to have a break in a hinge, so in the end they are not buying it. They want 5 euros for this H&M shirt. I mean, I think I could buy it new for that price. Non ci si vede, non ci siamo, scusi, non ci siamo. I just saw that a coffee pot is passing by. I guess I will show it to you in my hall at the end of this video. Com'è? Bello, sembra uno dei paesini mm. che abbiamo visto dall'autostrada. They want 60 or 80 euros for these paintings. Eh, C'è una piccola firma. Anche questo mi piace. 1980. Pesa. <ride> indipendentemente, indipendentemente. Lo non mi piace la cornice però. Vai là, da sempre lo stesso. Ah no, non lo stesso. 5 euro per... per la camicetta di H&M eh. voleva 5 euro oh. I keep finding items with these pretty drawings of country girls I just made a research and found that these illustrations are from the series of Sarah Kay or Holly Hobby and these are just reproductions but I must say that they are super cute.
Here is another cute elephant. I still can't understand what it could be used for, but the price is 25 euros and I have seen higher prices online. My husband loves this small extendable table. It can become round or even smaller than now and you can place it next to the wall. That's interesting. I am always looking for round baskets, just like this one, for my future home decor project. This plate is from the same series that we saw this morning, but princesses are not my kind. Molto Sembra cinese. Sì, però... Ha il Guarda, quello là, giapponese. Un altro elefante. Ok, we have found somebody who can tell me the provenance and use of these ceramic elephants. In the meantime, let's dig in the boxes, that is uh, lately our favorite spot. Everything for 1 euro, 2 euros or 3 euros and you never know what you can find. Ciao! Vieni a farmi vedere il nuovo outfit! Già, una giacchettina di velluto. Un giacchettino di velluto, mi piace. Bella colorata. Approvatissima. Super. It's lunchtime and we are super hungry. This is a bakery and pastry shop. After lunch we are going to see the last part of the market. I chose a huge French baguette with ham and mozzarella and this pastry that they call Eclair. Sì, mi piace la foglia. Here there is the famous carpet with the butterflies, but it was more than 300 euros. And uh, I have found two nice mirrors, but they cost uh, 45 euros each, so I don't know. This painting by the artist Borel is very pricey, more than 200 euros. A beautiful vintage dress, look at these colorful applications, the price is 20 euros. This part of the market seems more expensive, but also the level seems higher. We totally fell in love with this clothes hanger. Isn't it lovely? The owner says that it has a hundred years and it is a liberty style. The price is 90 euros. Allora fammi vedere i tuoi acquisti di oggi. Intanto acquisti di livello. La palla al piede. Ho dovuto vendere la mia libertà, ma ce l'abbiamo adesso. È un portabottiglie e poi in realtà c'è tutto quanto per la donna. Lele, ho visto comparire un oggetto interessante. Sì, abbiamo acquistato questo bellissimo sgabello dell'Ottocento. Sì. Viola! Hai visto? Ma è bellissimo! Sì, è Quanto contenta sei! I'm very happy! I'm very happy! Sì. Era del Vaticano prima di andare all'anno. Esatto. Papa Benedetto III. Andiamo a vedere il mare! Tre, tre, tre bien! Salut. Salut. Ah, 
home. Salut. Savoir. Now we are going to have a walk in the center of Marseille. There will be also a kind of a vintage surprise and then I will show you today's haul. So we are in the old town. This quarter is called Le Panier and there are small cafes and pedestrian streets with typical shops. We have found this Marseille soap shop. We could smell the perfume from outside. And I love all these soap bars with different colors and scents. The Marseille soap is famous all around the world and maybe we could bring home some souvenirs for our families. Daniele è già in fondo. <ride> Abbiamo trovato un altro negozio, vintage. Ma eh, questa tua vedi? ricerca smodata di caffettiera? Vedi, vedi 25. Eh. E, non è, e non è doppia. <ride> Guarda che bellezza questo mobiletto qua. Eh, però questo non te lo vedo. Non so. No, è vero? Abbiamo parcheggiato proprio sotto a questa basilica e c'è un panorama mozza fiato. And now it's time to show you today's haul. This is only a small part of it. We got the enamel coffee pot for our collection and now this is the biggest one that we have. The beautiful shabby chic tray shows some signs of use, but I got it for 5 euros and I think it will be useful for our future flower power party. And then the lovely vintage tin trays, they are so cute, I got them both for 3 euros. And this one is really a drawing by Holly Hobby. Then I got these nice floral skirts for only 1 euro. Next up, I got the straw basket. I like that it has also some stitching and repairs. It has surely been loved in the past. And then the crane. Look at him, how cute is he? Well, this mirror was only one euro and the seller was packing up everything and he gave me other two frames as a gift. And yes, I also got an elephant, it is super cool and it was only 5 euros, I couldn't leave it behind. Next up, I got some vintage clothes like this sequined vest, which is very fun and colorful, then two light blue leather belts, one has the tiny dog beans. And then this striped blazer, which I can't wait to style in an outfit. Then the Seiko watch, it's a quartz one with a very nice design and I will ask my mother to repair the band because she is very good with the jewelry repair. The red leather belt should have been in yesterday's haul but as you see I used it today and so here it is. Next up, I got the three gorgeous collector's plates for 9 euros. They belong to three different series and I will decide whether to keep them or resell them or maybe start collecting them, I don't know. These are the soap bars that we found for ourselves. Natural, lavender and verbena. And then we got the Liberty Clothes Hanger. It is so elegant, so well made and so cute with the little birds, I just couldn't resist. Where are we going to put this? I still don't know, but you will see it in one of my next videos. 
And last but not least, from the vintage shop in Marseille, we purchased this painting. I think that the landscape can remind us of the French countryside that we drove through during this holiday and we already put it in our travel wall. If you follow my channel, you already know these other paintings. They are all the good memories of our travels. And now it's your turn. Let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite item of the day. This is meat tartare with a vegetable ratatouille. And my niçoise salad. Well, the time has come to announce the winner <laughs> of today's competition, the one who found the most beautiful squirrel in the world. And the winner is, uh, as usual, Cynthia! This is all for today, but I wait for you in the next French episode, which will be in the city of Nice. We saved the best for last. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon. Bye!